Hello traders, welcome to Allies Blue. This is Deepan Google. So in this video, I'll discuss about the crude oil entry and exit point. So we'll analyze the crude oil, the target point. So in which direction we go for buy or sell today. So we'll discuss about this one. So this one you can see a bang, uh, sorry, uh, crude oil. So last few days, uh, crude oil is going up, uh, like uh, price is going higher, higher and higher. Uh, they are getting higher high and higher low so here you can see right they're creating higher high and higher low so here you can see so I told that that here is uh, like a neckline so they are forming a head and shoulder pattern so here you can see head and this is the right shoulder they are forming and in that case we create a neckline by connecting the previous higher point so resistance point so you can see here and yesterday like uh, not yesterday exactly uh, Friday they broke this resistance line so have you seen this one they broke this resistance line here right they broke this resistance line and the uh, prices first uh, today you can see price just opened the resistance line and it is uh, confirming that market will go up from this area but uh, what happened actually exactly sometime what happened so when they're breaking the resistance line like that uh, so here let me draw properly so this one resistance line so when they break this resistance line like that so prices again reverse toward the resistance line and start going up so here you can see they broke this resistance line and price may fail again to Toward the resistance line it will go up again so how we will confirm this one so I think if you oh, was my uh, previous video so you can see I uh, just a minute so if uh, price bounce uh, sorry uh, if uh, price bounce from that area so what is the area it may bounce right so in that case you can see in the daily this 100 moving average i draw a line here right so uh what happened exactly so already they broke this resistance uh, resistance line now they become another resistance line above around 4000 right so what happened it will go up near to moving average again it may fell right and then you can see that resistance become a support so there will be a support and start from uh, that area from the support area the price will start going up from that area right so here another option you can see here so if price sometime uh, what happened price doing continue from that area right it will break this area and it will go up around 200 moving average right so uh, if you see in the 15 minute like uh, previous video like uh, witness uh, like Friday I made a video I told that the price will go up from this area right I think you remember I just connected a line here so I told that price will go up from this 200 moving average and our target will be there so uh, let's see the next uh, that video so this uh, this was the video that now we can see there is uh, from this area so I expect the price will bounce from this area and here we have the moving average and the target will go up near previous higher point so I think it will be the previous level here so this one again very smart So here you can see, so uh, that day I told that uh, market will go up from that area. I think you remember that video next. I told that from that area, you just keep below the SL uh, 200 moving average like this one. So SL will be here and next target, I draw the line and target will be exactly hit the target. 
So what is our entry point today? All right. So in that case, you can see here. Uh, if you see in a four-hour chart or daily chart, whatever. So I told that they broke that neckline. Have you seen? They broke that neckline, and the price will go up near, I think, uh, four thousand. Uh, 100 level right so in that case where is your entry point for 15 minutes you can see price just uh, running above that uh, resistance line and uh, right now the price is running like here so this is the resistance line so still they are trying to break this resistance line according to the 15 minute so in that case what happened they're creating higher high and higher low so that is why price might be fell Toward the resistance line and it will go start going up so who people are start buying from this resistance line and they are keeping sl just 20 30 point below it will hit the stp and it will go up right it's happening with the trader mostly so that is why the you can see the right now price is running around 3973 so you wait to price reduce toward around 3900 if in case we are getting the price in this area to so start buying from this area exactly people are doing what the one price is failing people are thinking that yeah price is failing continuous so so let's go for sell so not exactly it's happening it's happening it's doing only retracement right so when price is doing retracement people are start selling so again start going up so that is where you just identify the trend right so you just identify the trend if able to find out the trend and chart pattern so i uh, i think you will get the enough uh, like a huge uh, big profit in this market so uh, today you can see in this market so price is running up right if you see in the daily chart also price is running up so here you can see four hour chart so price is running up right now but major trend is still downtrend but uh, there this is the correction right the form a head and shoulder pattern here if you see the whole entire it is from a head and shoulder pattern right so head and shoulder pattern is a like a trend reversal pattern right so you can see inverted head and shoulder pattern so they're confirming uptrend so we will take buy only so and We'll find, we will we have to find out the entry point so people who will start buying from this area right now you can see prices running in a range right uh, this is the main range if you see this is the like uh, this is the range right so the price is running like this range here you can see price is running like a range it may bounce again right so where it may bounce so in that case let me draw a line then it will be very clarified so i just connected this is the line okay this is another range right and another range uh, then range let me draw so here you can see this is the actual range the price is running in this range right they gone up bounce from there higher range lower range right gone up again break this break this area came to lower range right this is you can see another range here support support so another range here so price will go up now the price is just above this range we know price will go up everybody knows but people are buying here Keeping SL just near that one, the price will fall, then hit the STP, or they will bounce to it in this area also and start going up. And the people are thinking, "Hey, I just bought here, price falling down, my uh, hit hit uh, my SL, right? People bought here, price will uh, place SL here and hit the S SL. The people are thinking, "Hey, just I place a SL and hit the SL again, gone up." So not exactly people people are buying here. It is the big mistake. So that is why you just wait to re, uh, retrace uh, level, right? 
So you can see this is the retest level you just buy here when price will be around uh, 3900. Buy here, keep your SL just below by seeing this moving average 50 will be here. Ichimoku line will be just keep your SL here. If they hit the SL, don't sell it. Again, start buying from this area, right? From this area. Buy here, SL here, price will go up, right? Your, if you bought here, your risk reward ratio 1 is to 2. Here also 1 is to 2. Or here you can see 1 is to 5. You lost 1, 1, 2 and you got profit 5. That means 3 will be still profit for you, right? So I hope you enjoyed this video. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.